Hey guys, how's it going today? Welcome back to my channel of subscription sisters. So today we're going to be diving into another box that is new to me. I feel like all day I've been filming new boxes. This one I'm really excited about though. Like this is probably the box I've been looking forward to filming all day. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys. This is the Israel Pack. And this box was kindly sent to me for review, but a little bit of info about this box is everything in here is from, you guessed it, Israel. And the mission behind this box is to connect people to know more about their country, their land, and it's connecting farmers, artisans, and different creators out there so that they can share their talents with everybody else in the world. And we can learn more about them and their culture then. So. I thought this was great when I read about this and I went to their website, I was like, yep, this is something I definitely want to check out because honestly, I don't know much about Israel. I know biblically where it stands and I know that there's a lot of impact there, but outside of that, I don't know. What do they eat? I'm not really sure. So we're going to find out today. If you guys are interested in purchasing this box though, it is $99 a month with free shipping and they will send this out monthly to you guys. One cool thing I liked on their website, and I'm going to bring it out, it specifically says on there they are not looking for donations, they just want to sell boxes, and that is how you can support their mission. So I thought that was kind of unique. So if you guys do want to support them, definitely check them out, and I will list all of that down below in the bio as well. Let's first look at this packaging, though. I think this is so cute. It's got just little symbols on here that definitely make me think of Israel and I think this is really cool already. So on the side here it says open a door to Israel with their packing tape. So we're gonna go ahead and open this door and see what we have. I'm really excited about this. It's like I don't know what's gonna be in it so it's all the more exciting. So let's go ahead and do our first impressions here then. I don't want to drop anything. Ooh it's packed full. All right, so we've got some info on top here then. So the first thing I see is it says your summer vacation in Israel, and this is their catalog. Just trying to make room over here. So this is actually a very, there's 20 pages in this booklet. There's a lot here, but isn't that cute? Also on the back here, we do have all of the social media links, you guys. So if you're interested in checking them out, this is where you can look to find them. So let's go and open this up here. All right, so this booklet has a lot of different information in it, and I'm not sure if it's all of the products inside the box. So we're gonna come back to this in a moment here. The next thing that I have on top is a fairly big piece of information. I'm not sure what it is. It says it's an Israel trip of a lifetime vacation without leaving home. The global pandemic may be closing the skies, but there's no reason you can't still enjoy a trip around Israel. Here at Israel Pack, we've put together a trip of a lifetime just for you. Discover the products we've handpicked for you this month and enjoy a north to south tour of Israel. It'll help you learn more about our beautiful country and maybe even plan your next visit when everything gets back to normal. So it says our Holy Land highlights itinerary, your guide to enjoying the best. Day one, you're going to arrive at the port. You're going to be greeted by a pack tour, transferred to your hotel. This is cool. Literally every day it's showing what you would be doing on this itinerary. So then it goes on to the souvenir shopping. It's got photos. Oh my goodness. Look at all this information. So this is like your tour guide map that you'll have info on all of the products you visit. And check it out. Here's a map. This is so cool. I love it. So we literally are vacationing even though we're at home, which is the best part ever. This is really cool, you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and just slowly bring this up so you guys can briefly look through all of this. This is amazing. This is really cool. Okay. So... We haven't even got down into the box. The next thing that I have here is some tissue paper that's sealed with the Israel Pack logo. Let's go ahead and look at that. So this box is packed full of packing peanuts. So I went ahead and scooped off the top to show you guys how this box came to me. So in here, we have all of the items are individually wrapped. They have instructions on them and they're like miniature presents in here, which is the best way to open up boxes. 
So I have to show you guys this because packaging the attention to detail is amazing in this box. So let's go ahead and look at the first thing. It says, don't judge me by my cover. Just because I'm made from upcycled materials doesn't mean I'm not an art piece. Original eco-friendly artwork featured in Tel Aviv Illustration Week. I think that's how you pronounce it. All right, guys, so what we received is a gorgeous postcard here. And it, I'm going to show you the print here on the front. And then on the back here, it gives tribute to where you can write, but also tribute to who it created this design as well. So inside of our booklet, it says this is a handcrafted postcard. This lovely printed art postcard you just received is a result of a collaboration between two Israeli artists. So it says it features an original artwork created for an exhibition called Trashion, which took place during the Tel Aviv Illustration Week. This these artworks combined the exquisite botanical illustrations along with the upcycled collage work. So the artists were inspired by nature. So this is really cool that we have a custom made postcard. I like it. I think it's good. All right, let's move on to the next one then. So the next thing I have says, read with me. It says, and I will become your favorite book's best friend. This bookmark was created by an Israeli artist in collaboration with the Israel Museum, which features the most extensive holdings of biblical and Holy Land archaeology in the world. All right, so go ahead and open this one up. I got to tell you guys, this packaging is so nice. I, I'm, I don't want to ruin it. You know, it's like I'm being so careful. So we'll go ahead and look at this bookmark. Ooh, it's an aluminum bookmark. This is cool. So it comes in the little case. Check this out. That is so cool. So it's made from aluminum. You can tell too. I mean, it's thin, it will bend, but that is really, really cool. This is the coolest thing ever. I love, look at all that scroll work on there. That's really, really pretty. Oh my goodness, this is like amazing already. So then the next thing that I have is Smell Me, and I will show you the golden city of Jerusalem. This soap is inspired by the song Jerusalem of Gold, an unofficial anthem of Israel, full of biblical references and describing the Jewish people's 2,000 year longing to return to Jerusalem. Okay, so we're smelling this. And spot, oh, it said this soap is inspired. So we're going to receive some soap here. I'm like, read through the clues. What could it be? And it, it clearly said soap. So here is our little box. It's so cute. Premium handmade soap made with love, it says. There's almond oil in here, grapeseed oil, coconut oil. Oh, there's lots of good stuff in here. Let's look at this. So cute. It says Jerusalem on the front. Ooh. That smells amazing. But look at, isn't that cute? It's the little city. This smells really, really good. Oh my goodness, I love this. This is amazing. Okay, we're gonna keep going because there's lots in here still. This says, eat me. These are guilt-free berry candies. They're natural, delicious, and sugar-free. Nothing but the real fruit, so they're vegan friendly. All right, let's see what we have to eat. I was hoping there were gonna be treats in here, not just because I like to eat all the time, you guys, but I was like, if I'm really gonna explore Israel, I need to eat something. So, really glad these are in here. Ooh, these are like gummy snacks almost. Ah, so here's her cute little bag. I have no idea what any of this says, but I will say I like the packaging. I love the bright colors, so that's really nice. And yeah, like I said, I can't read any of this. So, all right. The next thing that I have is it's a sprinkle me on everything. And I will add an amazing and authentic Israeli zest to any dish you cook. This za'atar is a multi-purpose spice. It comes from Galilee, the area blessed with many herbs that have been the best aromatic flavor in the world. Okay. I'm excited about this. Okay. Coming from Galilee. Let's see what these are. Let's see here. What is in this? So here's our packaging. And ooh, I can smell it already. So there's lemon acid, salt, sesame. And then there's some different ingredients I've never heard of. So 
just says sprinkle on everything. Well, that's what we're going to do. I'm excited though to try this, you guys. This is a really cool shade. It's really good though. I would say that it's close to something like um, an Italian herb mixture. That's where this is going, but it's Israeli. So it's a little different. <laughs> so the next I have, it says, apply me to your nails and I will bring your fingers a little joy. Dreaming about a manicure during quarantine, this nail hardener is packed with minerals from the Dead Sea, which will strengthen and beautify your nails. All right, well, let's see what we have here. This is so cool. I love that all of these are individually wrapped. I'm sure this took them a lot of time to do. So here's our packaging and it just says that it's an oil treatment for your nails that comes from the Dead Sea and it will harden those nails up so that you'll have less breakage and you will just paint this on like a regular polish. Cool, all right. The next thing that I have is apply me to your cuticles. This is an oil treatment that will bring the nail salon to you. It's rich in minerals and it will stimulate healthy nail growth. All right, so that was, the last one was for our actual nails, but this one is for the cuticles, it says. I'm like a kid opening these up like, I gotta see what I got, what did they send me? And here is for our cuticles then. So same company it looks like and you'll just paint this one on again. Next, I have Wear Me and I Will Protect You With Style. This is a face mask from a Tel Aviv fashion designer turns hygiene into cultural expression. Literally, it's like a mask because of the pandemic. I love this. This is the first mask that I've received since the pandemic began. And I've been saying it over and over again that the companies that are adapting their subscription boxes to what's going on in the world are my favorite because they're listening, they're knowing what's happening, they're knowing what people are going to want at home. This is perfect. I give them mad props for sending this out during this time. Regardless if you wear a mask or not, this is relevant to our situation now. So I appreciate that a lot. So here's our pattern. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit more here. And it's got the two straps that are gonna go right over the ears. I don't really wanna put this on right now, otherwise it's gonna leave a mark on my face. But um, I really like to, this is a fairly good size mask. So this is going to cover exactly where it needs to be. Now, if you have a much larger face than I do, then it might not be as big as you would need it, but I think it's great. So, awesome. All right, so then I have another one that says eat me. It says this is the most biblical snack because it's made up of only two ingredients and both of them are mentioned in the Bible. Dates and almonds, no sugar added. Ooh, okay, you got me there. I love both of these, so this is a good thing to have in the box. Ooh. Okay, I thought it was just gonna be like plain, but this is like a treat. This is exciting. I keep looking on the packaging and then I remember that, oh yeah, I can't read this. So this is the Tamar snack with almond filling inside of it. And it does list everything for your ingredients over here. And it just says it's dates and almond butter. There's no added sugar to it as well. So I do like that. It's nothing artificial that they sent. So then I have another one that says, eat me. It says, guilt-free peanut butter chocolate cookies. Your taste buds will confuse this healthy snack for a dessert. Low sugar, low carb, and high in protein. <gasps> Ooh, these look like little truffles in here. Look at this, we got a whole box. Oh my goodness, peanut butter and chocolate cookies. High plant-based protein cookies, and these are vegan even. This is great, you guys. So we received 10 items inside this box today, you guys. And overall, I am very pleased. This gave me everything that I was expecting from this box. I love that we're getting a little bit of food in here to try different items. I love the unique things that are coming from Israel, especially the spices. That bookmark is the coolest thing ever. I love that. Um, so I think there's a lot of great pieces. I love that they're listening to the world, seeing what's going on with the pandemic and adapting as well with like the face mask. So there's a lot of high points in this box. I think this is really well done. It's very well curated. I love the touches of hand wrapping every item. 
I just, I think it's really good, you guys. So if you guys want to learn more about Israel, definitely check out this box. I have the link listed down below for you guys. And if I do have any coupon codes, I'll list all of that as well. So definitely check it out. But let me know what you guys think of this box today. Comment down below, share your thoughts. If any of you have been to Israel, let me know too. I'd love to hear what your experiences were like, because I haven't and I probably won't be considering, you know, pandemic and all. But all right, guys, have a fantastic rest of the day out there. Stay safe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.